Hello everyone and welcome back to Fixing Tiny Tedious Things. In this video, I'm going to create a website from scratch which is on WordPress and I'll be integrating that WordPress website with Cloudflare CDN and I'll get Cloudflare SSL certificate for the website as well. So let's do that right away. Here is what the website looks like right now. It's merely a domain name holding nothing. The domain name is entrancetestinfo.com. So let's use this domain and create a website from scratch so for that i'm going to log into my control panel c panel of godaddy i use godaddy if you want if you want a discount for godaddy just go to the description box of this video and you will see a link there just click on that and you'll get discount for any product you buy on godaddy okay so here we are inside the c panel we now need to create a fresh installment of WordPress for entrance test info.com. I use software called install, install Tron application installer, which is under software section in GoDaddy C panel. So let's click on it. Now from here, you need to click on applications browser. If you don't already have other application installed here, it should be here just click on it and find a wp wordpress blog it should be apps for content manager management under so let's click on wordpress and again go to application browser pick the wordpress blog and from here click on install this application Now choose your domain here. It should be here. So I'll be using the first one HTTPS entrance test info. And now you can get rid of this and scroll down. Use a username and password. I go with the admin and my password is going to be okay this and my email is going to be this we can leave the title as it is and tagline as it is scroll down and click install through this software we don't have to create databases separately everything will be managed by the software and the installation will be done like in five within five minutes it takes actually less than that and as we speak it is already halfway through you can see here it is copying database and tables we are almost done all right so we have the wordpress installed on our website domain so let's see by clicking here here is entrance test info and it is not secure we need to get an SSL certificate for this domain so for that I'm going to use Cloudflare in Cloudflare I get SSL certificate with one year of validity so for that just go to cloudflare.com create your account if you don't have it already I already have that so I'm logged in so first thing you need to do is just click on add a site and put the URL here entrance test info.com and click on add site from here select your plan i always go with free because i don't have that budget to go with the paid ones so for now let's select free and click on confirm plan from here cloudflare will investigate the dns records of the domain and here are the records that are fetched by cloudflare next we need to continue click on continue so that we can do the name server changes as per cloudflare instructions so we need to make sure we have these name servers instead of the godaddy ones because i use godaddy for that i need to go to my godaddy domain manager dns so i'm already there so here it is and here I am in DNS management. 
I need to change name servers for that I need to scroll down and find change name servers option here it is I need to click on change scroll down and here enter my own name servers click on it and here I need to put the values from Cloudflare so let's take those values this is the first one let's put it in DNS name server here it is copy the second value come back paste here and click on add, save from here select this box and give it consent and click on continue So it will take about one to two minutes for this to propagate properly and the name servers to reflect in cloud flare account so let's go back and click on done and check name servers okay after clicking i landed on this page from here you need to select the type of encryption you want for your website for now i'm going to select full and i'll also make sure that always use https is always on by default it is off but right now it was showing on but i am going to off and on now and it should be on 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 the all the time now scroll down again and click on done all right the propagation has completed great news cloudflare is now protecting your site here are some commonly used options to review so we have successfully integrated our website with the cloud player and now download one plugin which is called flexible ssl from cloudflare let's do that and activate it and here you need to search flexible ssl here is the plugin just install now and click activate that's done and there's one more thing that you can do just always make sure your inside your settings you need to go to general and you have https prefixed here instead of http and hit save changes alright so the website is done so if I now click on and check you can see the padlock here so SSL certificate is installed now I can show the information click here click on certificate and you can see issued to this ID and issued by Cloudflare INC valid from 7th of September 2022 7th of September 2021 one year of validation all right so this is what you need to do if, if there is any question you have about the same please comment down below i'll answer all your questions thank you for watching and subscribe please if you are new to my channel thank you